Jeff, what's happening right now? Well, Eric is stuck in the washroom. And at the beginning, I assumed that one of the older guys was just kind of messing with him. But it appears they're actually trying to help him break out as well. So yeah. I'm thinking he's actually stuck. He's real stuck. We got another day out in Florida. We got Jeff again. Another day. What Still no day? dollars. What's he have in his hand? I have a bird book today. Jeff has a bird book to show all of us about birds. I do, I do. And my dad Coke. Oh, I dad also Coke. brought my dad Coke today. He's set. It's a little rainy though. Oh, there is a punch cooler. We're good. We got Tom. And we're fired up and ready to go. All right, so I left a hoodie on the Jared, bus yesterday nothing? for today because it's going to be colder. The only person who's off the hook. And my mom freaking took it. Yep, so Jeff uh, thought he was going to go coach in sandals and no socks. Yeah, that's right. My best. Sandals and socks are acceptable, but you know I tried what? My best, but it wasn't happening for me. Yep. I got caught. <laughs> Alright, we're out here at the field right now. Uh, it's looking really nice. We actually have a ground screw ground today. today. They're actually doing stuff. This is weird. Well, we were the ground screw yesterday. We were. It was great. We it did a great job. Really good job. Jeff, how do you feel about today and uh, the outcome that might happen? I think. We're starting off on, our, on the right foot here. We got a ground screw with multiple vehicles. We got yes. a tractor out here today. Yeah, they do so have a tractor. Uh, it looks like we're going to be able to avoid the hand drag. And, uh, <laughs> and that's a plus because I'm too fat for that. Um, <laughs> other than that, the boys say this team we're playing is full of man childs, but we all know there's only one real man child, so that's not possible. Yes, he's over there somewhere. Hitting dingers. Probably not. Hopefully, maybe hit a dinger. He might have. We'll see it after. But probably not on the big field for the first time. Yeah, that's true. Um, but uh, yeah, I think, uh, I think what, what's, what's that quote? Um, um, just, just here to play the game. Just or here to play the game. Every ball, ball has its day. Oh. Something like that. Yep. Something like that, yeah. Yeah, I think that's one of them. Um, see the ball be the ball. See the ball be that's the a ball. a good one. Get that away from my head. <laughs> and... Uh, yeah, I think that's that's a that's a that's a good cliche. Whoa, that's not pretty cool. Hurry up! 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 Hurry Whoa, photographer Izzy, what are you doing over there? Lupino. Take a picture. Okay, yeah, good. good. Lupino. Can we take some good ones? Sure. <laughs> yeah. John was in on that. John. John was hey, somebody John. on that ball. Let it boys, let's go. Get out there. Oh, oh yeah. Oh, on the cement. <laughs> Better not beat you. Yeah. Oh, 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 come easy, on. Easy, easy. Oh, like we're ever going to get another call now. <laughs> My bank's so bad. Yeah, so at least it's not me this time. Hey! Derby! Derby! Don't roll the ball through that grass! Figure it out! Oh Man, nice. That's why we don't let the play. Nailed it. That boy fishy. Good job. Alright, we just finished up the first game of the day. We have Jeff here as the What's third up? base coach. Yeah. So how'd the game go today, Jeff? How well, we got one hit. Yep. And uh, so that's not great. We had a lot of fun though. The uh, 16 new coaching staff joined us for a little while. Oh, so that was, was a great time. That was a great time. So it's, <laughs> it's like we can get a guest appearance by uh, Bob Lofgren. You know it's a good day. He's one of the funniest people we know. He is one of the funniest people I know. <sighs> Frankie poops. <laughs> All right, so I'm just in the lobby right now. Got the glove ready to go. Just gonna write up a letter. Got a mystery package in. We're gonna open up that. Open that up in a second, and then we have some Leadberry bats are gonna be shipped out. So we're gonna have to do that on our way. Back to the field tomorrow, or maybe tonight. Then we also have this package. It's a nice little shirt going up to Glove Love Co. All right, so we have the mystery package in the room right now. Uh, I'm not sure if I told you what it was. I probably did, actually, so it's not even a mystery package. It could be a mystery package for some of your viewers. Yes. If you're new to the show, mystery package. Mystery package, here we go. But like I said it like two seconds ago in real life. Oh, like on camera? Like, like today, today I said it, so. So first thing we gotta do is get through the packing tape. Yep. We don't have a knife, so we're using uh, one of John's old shirt uh, tags. If you happy to know, he got it. 50% off. $20 shirt, $9.99. Real good deal. Go and I will Walmart. anecdotally say, he has worn it every day since we got here. <laughs> yeah. Every day. <laughs> every day. Actually, it's the only thing he's worn. He sleeps in it as well. Um, 
you know, you know it's a good quality package because we got some of these. Keep those. You know, oh, I, I need things. those. Like I need those. Oh, and for my we're gonna gloves. actually keep the rest yeah, so Mitch can I have them because apparently he needs this one's. That one sucks. Yeah, this is a little dangerous. I need that one, but it's okay. Um, I popped that one. My bad. Okay, let's see what uh, else we got. So first thing we got coming out of the thing is a red bag <laughs> and. Uh, <laughs> And <laughs> real nice red bag. And a real nice red bag. It looks like a memory card. Am I it's to look quality in? memory card. Oh, it is a memory card. It's a memory card. So and, uh, DJI. Other than that, probably bought that, but whatever. We got the uh, we got the mystery white box here. So we're gonna be done oh, with that. My goodness. And uh, there it is, folks. We got a drone. Woo! In real time, Mitch Lumley has a drone. I have a drone. And we're gonna open it. It's gonna, a fly more combo gonna, too. We're gonna. It's a fly more combo. So yeah. We're gonna fly more because we're gonna crash it right away. Yeah, and uh, the good news is we have the insurance, so when we crash this into the ocean in about 20 minutes. Yeah. We can. Uh, we can just get a new one. Wow, and, nice. Uh, good opening too. I need to keep that box. Yeah. Yeah, that's quality right there. Quality opening. So far, real quality installment. This. Has wow. Been. Look at the box. Dude. Look at the box. It's so white. So white. So, so shiny. How long until it's charged? Charged, I don't know, we gotta Spark get- Spark fly more combo. We're gonna get set up right now. John is uh, yelling things from the bathroom, and we're not really sure why. Should we open it? Open it up. Try it. Fi figure it out, Jeff. All right, you know what? I don't have any nails, because I bite them. You have one For any, job. any, any viewers that bite their fingernails, you should stop that now. It's a nasty habit. Yeah, you're disgusting. Yeah, I'm gross. Let's see another one. All Jeff right. does not. There's this one here, too. And, uh, we're trying to keep the box. Put your fingers into the box. Yeah. We're, we're trying to. We're trying to keep the box. <laughs> right through it. The just... box nice and shiny here for Mitch. <laughs> That's what she said. <laughs> this is no longer usable footage on air. So. Yeah, it is. Bad, Badger's Daily. Badger's Daily. There's John eating salami. Ninety <laughs> nine cents. It's really good. All right. Um, this Mitch... uh, unboxing is brought to you by Waltney cooked salami made with chicken and pork. Oh. Available at? Winn Dixie. Winn Dixie. There you go. <laughs> All right, we, uh, we are into the box, folks. Okay, here we go. Um, it's a multi part box. And, That's what uh, she said. <laughs> <laughs> and uh, the first thing that's going to come out is this black package. That's what she <laughs> said. <laughs> <laughs> and uh, Mitch actually bought a. I, the case came with the, the fly more. Oh package. yeah, the case came with the fly more. Wow, look at that styrofoam. Look at this really quality case. We're gonna pull the styrofoam right out here. I hope maybe you're not supposed to. And uh, looks like a drone. Oh, I see uh, the first signs of a battery charger. Battery charger, okay, we're set. We got battery charger. That's good. That's Still good. haven't seen a drone yet. Kind of getting uh, disappointed. We have a control uh, controller. Okay. It's actually doubles the uh, PlayStation Four controller. Oh wow. So right. that's that's good. Really useful for Fortnite. Really good weight. Great for Fortnite, yeah. Oh, these are uh, these are Play rotors. We got rotors. Rotors. Jeff knows his rotors. Yeah, those are rotors, I, I think, and yep. uh, power cord. That's some boring shit. Um, I mean, power is important. That's good, kinda, Jeff. Power is important. Yeah, that's fair. All right. And you know where you get power oh, from? That's some, that's some Salami. Here. <laughs> <laughs> it's all right. I'll eat it so. We got a uh, docking station, and I'm not really sure what, <laughs> that felt in your mouth. what this is. So there's a cord, and uh, right now the uh, now the black box is totally empty. Okay, so I'm not seeing a drone yet. Um, it's kind of sucks. It's oh, all right, and uh, we also in the box we got this. Um, it looks like an owner's manual or something, and we're not going to do with the yeah. reading. We don't do the reading here. We all can't read. This That's looks actually... promising, though. <gasps> It actually does. Oh, unfortunately, it is locked. There is a padlock. Uh, oh no, no, I'm just a bitch. Ta -da. Woo! There it is. Look at that drone. Blue for Lum's lacing, I think. Blue for Lum's lacing. Definitely sand on the floor. Yeah. Definitely eating sand. Right definitely now. eating sand. <laughs> Sweet. All right, we're here uh, for the maiden voyage of maiden voyage, Mitch's one, drone. Right I forget what you named it. We named him Ricky. Ricky right, the drone. We're so gonna start over. Right All right, we're here for the maiden voyage of Ricky. Ricky the drone. We Ricky got the Mitch drone. the pilot, obviously. Right here. We got Tom. Tom's our flight engineer. <laughs> we got John, 
John's in a hoodie. He's in a bad spot. We're not really the sure. Wind's, the wind's going right he's our, uh, yeah, he's our, uh, whatever that guy is. And, uh, and here's the drone. So here goes our Ricky. Oh, rotors are up. Here it goes. It is off the ground. Nobody knows how to fly this thing. Nobody has a clue what's going on. Mitch is flying into a pole. Right, uh, right stick. I think we got it. No, we definitely have it. Mitch has it. The drone is uh, the drone is being flown by Mitch right now. No. Tom, the flight engineer. Ex excellent job. Oh, here we go. And the drone is leaving. Yeah, we got some spectators, unexpectedly, but that's okay. Guest appearances from uh, Eric Pettipiece, Myron, and Ward. Ricky's still flying. John's still wearing a hoodie. Yo, that was smooth. It's just really windy. Jeff, what's happening right now? Well, Eric is stuck in the washroom. And at the beginning, I assumed that one of the older guys was just kind of messing with him. But it appears they're actually trying to help him break out as well. So yeah. I'm thinking he's actually stuck. He's real stuck. This is the fourth guy who's gone back to try rescue him. Seem to have made some progress. There's a crack in the door now. There's a crack in the door. He's trying his best, though. He's trying to get out. We're at the field right now. Um, we're missing one player. He's currently stuck in the bathroom on the bus. Oh, oh, oh. He's coming? Wait, is he coming? Is he out? Yeah! Hey, he did it! Woo! Yeah, right here. We'll grab him for an interview, John. Uh, get the mallet. You got the. Oh, you got the mic. Going through your mind when you were stuck in the toilet for however long you're in there. Um. I don't know, a lot of things. I didn't even know if I was gonna make it out of there. It was, it was stuck pretty good. Well, yeah. glad to see you're alive. Good luck today. Thank Have you. a good game. All right, thank you. Bye. <laughs> All right, we just finished up our game uh, with the men's senior league right now. We got Jeff here doing hey, an interview. Yeah. Where's our uh, Where's our mic? Who has our mic? I have it. Oh, you we have We don't a use mic. a mic for this interview. We oh, never okay. use a mic for oh, this interview. Oh, you're right. No, no, no. Yeah. Hey. Classy mix up. Shit, guys. Oh, I'm being yelled at for the equipment, but that's not our problem. So not, we're we gonna go. keep going. We're gonna no keep going. Swearing. Get some equipment. That's You're still in that room. Okay, Jeff. Yeah, what's my question today? Oh, what's your question? How'd the games go today? That's a classic right there. Uh, I thought it was pretty good. Um, a little surprised. We were playing a senior team. Yep. Uh, average age about 96. <laughs> but uh, <laughs> but highlight actually, the, highlight of the day, I will say, notice the second baseman moving a little slowly. Made a couple real athletic plays. Found out later, Doug Flutie. Doug Flutie Doug showed up. Doug Flutie. Pretty solid. Still an athlete. Age 55. Uh, nice enough to come shake the hands at the end of the game. I'd uh, be on the lookout for a picture with the coaching staff. We will have a good picture. There's a picture with the coaching staff. Oh, it's getting real dark right now. Yeah. Oh, and we're live. Welcome to another episode of Badgers Daily. Special guest today, Jared Lund. Yo, I'm up. Jared's here on uh, Badgers Daily. Jared's here on Badgers Daily today. Hey, Jared. It's a tough game today. How does it feel to be the shortest guy out there? It's pretty good, but I think I might be taller than you. So um, definitely not taller than me. We have this confirmed. Also, on we're on camera. video right now. Um, so I ask again, how does it feel to be the shortest guy out there? It's, it's okay. It's uh, kind of weird being so far down when I rise up so high up. Do you find yourself <laughs> with a lot of neck pain? No, not really at all. <laughs> Why would I have pain? Looking up all the Looking time. Up all the time. Oh, Jesus I see now. I see now. I was going to do it for Jared Lund. <laughs> You're cut. Get out of here. Hey, good luck. Yeah, thanks. Good, good luck. luck. Game. Yeah, thanks for your time. Well, who do we have here? Coach uh, Ward. Lumley? Ward? Ward, there he is. This is who we wanted. We're here with uh, Ward. He's one of our uh, our Windsor friends. and He pitched the second half of this game pretty well. Um, the question we have for you is how does it feel to have given up 
What is probably the biggest foul home run in Badgers history? Uh, from what I'm aware of, it was a three-pitch strikeout. It was a foul ball, so <laughs> I'm not worried about it. Jeff Short. We maintain, though, biggest foul ball in Badgers history. <laughs> it's a strikeout. <laughs> Get on the bus. <laughs> Good job, Ward. You killed it today.